gunfire, and panic. Yeah, it was like boom, 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 boom. Yeah, it was back to back. Ninth grader Corey Thomas and his classmates at Atlanta's Benjamin E. Mays High School ran for cover. Okay, so we're confirming there are going to be a total of four people shot at the location. Someone had shot and wounded four students in the Mays High School parking lot as school was letting out for the day. Just before the gunfire, there had been a fight, police say, and school police showed up and were there, and that's when someone began shooting. Video from a witness shows two of the students being taken away for treatment. Mays High School is Atlanta Mayor Andre Dickens' alma mater. Yeah, I'm shocked and heartbroken. The yeah. mayor describing all that the city has been doing to try to reduce Reduce youth violence. But incidents like today, where young folks can have access to a gun, this is concerning and is dangerous. Families of the wounded students with them at Grady Hospital, as police at Mays High School worked into the night, interviewing some 100 possible witnesses. Police promising more security at the school immediately. I'm still scared. This was Corey Thomas's first day at Mays. He and his family had just moved to Atlanta. I'm like frightened. Corey's mother, Ebony Steele, not sure she'll let him go back. Honestly, I need to have a conversation with the school um, about safety measures, not just for my son, but for all students and for the staff as well. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.